Good morning, YouTube! It is the morning of day three of life on the road. We're gonna stop at a gym because it's been a couple days since both of us have, have showered. We've like done the, how do, you, how do I describe this? We've done the like wipe down kind of shower, but we haven't had actual showers. So we're gonna go to a gym, get a good workout, shower, and then we will be at our first destination in the Black Hills, South Dakota. It's 11 a.m., already 80 degrees outside. And this is where we slept. There were a couple more RVs like that. This like boat dude just pulled in recently. Not that that matters. That is it. Boats. What'd you say? Because you hate boats. Super cool. I am editing some content, so this is all footage from the Allegheny National Forest that I'm working on. I'm trying to get this video up as soon as possible. It'll be my first time uploading a video from the road. Could get interesting. <laughs> Look at the lots of blood! <laughs> So we get to where we're going and there is another tornado warning. Great. We were going to go to the north side of it towards like Deadwood, uh, but there are tornado warnings in that area so we're going to stay further south. Oh man, that's a big hail. There's a rainbow! And we found a gorgeous camping spot. Check it out! We have officially made it to our first campsite and we are all alone here. Look at how beautiful. Just look at that. And although it was hailing for a bit and raining, the rain has passed. Obviously the sun is out and we're charging up our battery with solar. Um, so all is good. We just need to finish getting set up. I'm gonna put the camera down so I can help Nick because I feel like I'm being <laughs> vlogging instead of helping. So let me help. Oh, there's so much to explore. This is so cool. It's gonna be a good couple of days. <laughs> it is morning of day four, I believe. Is it already day four? I don't know. I'm losing track of the days, which is probably a great thing. Last night was so good. Just so peaceful and quiet. Cranky, 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 cranky. is made. This works off of propane so we will use this eventually but just for this morning. I made a bowl of oatmeal and another one for Nick. So the oatmeal is just oats, chia seeds, raisins, honey, and walnuts and Nick has some protein powder in his. That's breakfast! We bought a couple of flies that the fella in the shop recommended for this area and then we got this cool indicator for nymphing, which I'm very excited to use. So, that's the update. This town's pretty cute. We're in Rapid City in their like Main Street area and there were a lot of cool things. You guys got it going on. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Excuse me. How you guys doing? Hey. So the cows have uh, decided that they want to hang out with us. I'm cool with that. Mm -hmm. Look at them, they're cute. Except they're probably going to be mooing all night. Ooh, that looks a little creepy. It's a red candle. 
gets in the yellow candlelight. Nah, still creepy. That is a wrap for day four of life on the road. Nick's in bed, getting some work done on the computer. I'm about to get in bed and do some editing. You know, work hard, play hard. We have some visitors. I am getting up to set up the solar panels and uh, look who's here. Excuse me. Get, come on, go, go lady, go, go, go babies, <laughs> babies, hey babies, you guys gotta get out of here, sorry, sorry, like look, they pooped everywhere, oh man, there's a lot of you, goodbye everybody, that's it, yep, I know. Last night, they were bumping into the trailer, like in the front of it where the hitch and the propane is. So I went out to make sure that they weren't, I didn't think that they would do this, but like chewing on any wires or uh, messing something up. And I get out here and it's just two of the little ones just like rubbing up against the propane tank. That was pretty funny. And it happened twice and then that was just almost the third time. But they were just rubbing on the propane, having a great old time. I got too hungry and I started eating before I could film it, but Nick hasn't started eating yet. Look at how beautiful! Our breakfast keeps getting better and better. So we just spent a lot of time sitting in front of a computer, editing, answering emails, doing all the work that we need to do. And now that the work is done, we are going to go fishing. It'll be my first time ever fishing in South Dakota. So I'm pretty excited. And the weather is beautiful. A little bit chilly when the wind blows, but not complaining. wanted to go we drove around for an hour oh there's a deer oh that's a log never mind <laughs> we drove around for over an hour right over an hour about an hour trying to find this spot I thought I knew where we were going it wasn't and Nick actually found it not actually it's not surprising <laughs> Beautiful. Probably my favorite fly. Nick spotted a brook trout. And he looks like he's pretty close to the surface. And the water is crystal clear. And it's moving at a good speed, so. Let me give it a try. I'm so excited. There are the biggest trout that I've ever seen, which is making me freak out. These trout are rising and feeding off of the surface. I've had one hit and I missed it, but they've rose multiple times since then. Although they did hit this once, they were hitting other things and not looking at this for the most part. So I'm gonna change it and if if nothing hits, then I will tie a nymph on the end of it. See if I can catch something. I'm genuinely so excited, like nervous excited right now. I 
not going after mine. So, I don't really know. I'm tying a clinch knot, an improved clinch knot, off the bottom of the stimulator, and I'm going to nymph and use my stimulator as an indicator. That was a fish, that was a fish. Oh my God, that was a fish. That's it. I suck at nymphing, but that was a fish. That's it. There's food inside of it. <laughs> Don't judge me. I'm on try about one hundred and twenty. <laughs> to try and get these damn fish. There's so many in there. We can see them. They are stocked fish. So we are going to try a lovely pink San Juan worm. And this guy, I can't remember the name of this guy. We bought this fella at the fly shop yesterday and we're gonna give it a try. Mm -hmm. 